And now to a health alert. VDH has issued a swim advisory for areas of Buckrow Beach and Hampton. The advisory will affect areas at the end of South Resort Road by the James T. Wilson Fishing Pier and the Buckrow Beach Park and Pavilion. The move comes just hours after a swim advisory at the Virginia Beach Oceanfront was lifted. That advisory prohibited swimming along several popular blocks of the beach. Even though that advisory has been lifted, some people are still cautious about getting into the water. Brianna Fallon has the story. Normally, on a summer day, the Virginia Beach oceanfront is flooded with people. It's generally a really nice place to vacation. But recently, a change of pace for beachgoers who hope to take a dip in the ocean. If we were just starting off our vacation, I'd be pretty disappointed. On Wednesday afternoon, the Virginia Beach Department of Public Health issued a swim advisory from 22nd to 37th streets due to high levels of bacteria, meaning swimming was prohibited. We uh, routinely uh, monitor the, the beach water in Virginia Beach every Tuesday from mid-May through the end of September. When advisories like this happen, officials are forced to shut down the waters, but not the whole beach. But at least you could build like a sand castle or something. Now, today, with flood watches happening around the area, many people might not be affected by this advisory. However, with a more sunny forecast on the way this weekend, tourists who traveled out to the beach hope it gets lifted soon. And luckily for them, it did. According to Environmental Health Supervisor Brad Delashmutt, this advisory was lifted at 10 a.m. this morning. But despite this, some people are still skeptical about jumping into the water. I'll be cautious for the first few hours and then maybe go in. Lashmutt hopes this will be the last advisory issued this summer. It's, it's pretty rare. Virginia Beach is known for its good water quality. Still better knowing this advisory was short-lived. In Virginia Beach, Brianna Fallon, 13 News Now. And officials tell us swim advisories happen around three to four times a year. 98% of the time they clear up within 24 hours.